Don't anything here yet. That's alright. I'll just sit here and eat my breakfast until someone turns up. I'll put my camera on. You can watch me eat. If you want. Morning, Mo. How we doing? Oh, put my coffee back over there because it's bloody hot. Bloody hot, that is. I put milk in it today. It's still bloody fucking hot. I'm drinking that straight away. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Just come fresh out the kettle, that. Good morning, Adam. I'm going to go to fucking... I'm buzz buzz on my fucking phone. Oh. It's Aiden. Good morning. How are we doing? It's, uh, it's Monday again. Um, it's not fun. But hey, this Monday I have to go into university. At 10 o'clock. I'm meeting my friend at half past nine. So that means I have to leave her about quarter past nine. Um, I haven't slept because honestly, I got into bed last night. Got into bed. I don't know. I actually don't know what time I got into bed. What time? Would, what, what, what the fucking time did I get into bed? Um, let's have a look. That means playing the piano slash keyboard. What does... What does... Uh, I reckon I got into bed about 1, 1 a.m. No. 1? 1 a.m.? Yeah, 1 a.m. I reckon. Maybe, don't really remember. And... Uh, I just wasn't able to sleep. I just couldn't sleep. I was browsing Reddit, looking at articles. I spent a long time reading Netflix tech blogs. Really fucking interesting shit there. And um, it rolled around to about, no, four or five. I think it was about four. No, I don't know, whatever time it was. And I decided that I'd work on a thing that I'd been thinking about for a while. Um. I basically decided to build the status page that I want for my personal stuff. I want a little status page that um, tells me um, stuff. Well, it doesn't tell me. It's not about. It's not about information for me. Hey, Polar. It's about being able to see a, a, stash, a status of my sites, basically, and. Um, yeah, so I, I took an existing project that someone had made. Um, basically, 
It runs on Cloudflare workers. It's just a simple status page. It pings the servers every minute, every hour long, stores the data, and um, displays it on a page. That's the default version of it. I have hacked together an incident management system into it using um, GitHub, GitHub issues. So I've got a repo on my GitHub that I can make issues in and it automatically shows that an issue and I'll, sh I'll show you. Or you can see it yourselves if you go to status.pomerose.site I'll quickly show you. Have I, got, have I got the right thing on? Hang on. There we go. Quick show. This is what it looks like. God, my camera's in the fucking way. Ah, that's alright. Um, so all this, all this bit, that's all default of the the, the the open source stuff that I've forked. And in this instance, but is why I added, and this is all based off GitHub. So if I click this link, it will take me to the, the GitHub issue. This is a test incident. I opened it this time. Uh, it's only it only tracks issues with the label incident. Nothing, nothing crazy. Hmm. That's the default. I haven't changed it. Um. And so it's all running on the edge. So if any of my shit goes down, my status page don't go down. And this, this in theory could be free. I pay for the Cloudflare workers plan, which is $5 a month minimum. And then anything you use on top of that. Um, it's kind of pay as you go. Um, I don't know how expensive it's going to be. We'll find out. It'll be a nice experiment to run for the month. And we'll see how expensive it is at the end of it. If it's less or more expensive than the paid alternatives you can go get that are made, ready made and work. Because like, I have, I have one, I have better uptime set up as well just for one project just so I have something else reliable working and um, that uh, well so this isn't for like alerting or monitoring this is like status page observability for other people outside of me basically um, not monitoring anyway I have better uptime which is my monitoring for that one site that I care about um, and um, I'll go back to chai chai screen, and um, they 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 see they have a free plan where you can get email notifications and checks every five minutes and up to thirty sites or something. I can't remember. Or the next plan up is twenty four dollars a month, which is quite a lot, I think, personally. That's their like hobbyists package $24 I think that's a bit quite a lot of money whereas I could pay nothing or about five hopefully five pounds a month hopefully that's it for that and um, yeah get pretty much very similar features I guess I kind of made this myself I didn't make the, the base of it but I made the incident bit. I have Uptokuma running, but it went down on that now that I'm messing up with my ingresses on my cluster. Now stop messing with your ingresses. I do have a project that I want to do at some point this week, next week, which is to start a Kubernetes cluster on my uh, on some of my stuff. Um, probably run nginx ingress. Um, yeah, but um, and that by the way, exactly what you do run into test page. Exactly, that is exactly why you don't run into test page. It's always been like why f for ages, OVH pretty much ran. Well, it wasn't really a status page, 
it was like an internal task list kind of that acted as a sort of status page um but they got rid of that actually they'll get rid of it they've got proper status pages now so that's good it's uh it's day two of alternate milk because for those who didn't hear it yesterday i bought some alternate milk because um if i buy dairy like proper dairy milk from a cow right i will forget about it and it'll go off right that's basically the the the, the reasoning i could buy uht milk yes but i thought i'd try some alternate milks just to see because i always wanted to try them see what they're like you know just something a bit different and um so this today's day two yesterday i had it in my cereal and today i've got it in my cereal and in my coffee it's not too bad actually i've got almond milk i was expecting it to be sweeter if i'm completely honest um because almonds are quite sweet and i've always heard that almond milk is quite sweet but maybe i maybe i bought just a not a, an unsweetened one or something i don't know But anyway, as I was saying, I do want to run um, a little Kubernetes cluster. Um, I was looking, I was doing some research every night um, into, because I want to use my existing hardware, so the daddy, the daddy that I have in Finland with Hetzner, I want to utilize that as a part of it, because it's got a lot of resources, and they're not really being utilized massively. Um, so quite like to use that um but finding that's one that's one instance all right that's one node so i could do a single node but i also want some of uh, the stuff that i want to deploy on it would probably i would want to be somewhat ha well not ha but fault tolerant basically so should one of the instances go down for whatever reason, it's okay. Um, and my kind of thought process behind that was, I'll put them with different providers and different different data centers, um, and that will help. But I realized very quickly after thinking that, that trying to get some VPSs or whatever in Finland at a decent price would be somewhat difficult. Um, Volta do them. Volta have them in Finland. Um, and I get about 20, 20 milliseconds? 20 milliseconds of latency to my daddy. Um, which isn't too bad. And was it Volta? They did it in Finland? No, they didn't do it in Finland. They did it in Amsterdam. Or was it Frankfurt? Might be in Frankfurt. Probably Frankfurt. Um, that's exactly what it was. It was Frankfurt. Because um, Volta are like, I, as far as I can tell, one of the very few cloud companies that have... Um, have a looking glass and allow you to do like a ping from their server. I know, um, I know OVH have one. But OVH didn't really have any data centers where I'd want one. Um, but yeah. I just use OVH. OVH ain't bad. Not awful. Um. Scaleway for doing offsite backups. Fair enough. I looked at Scaleway actually. Scaleway, scale, scaleway elements. I didn't see bad. I didn't see more. 
but expensive if I if I remember correctly from what I looked at somewhat expensive you have mirrors a month for you what's that for what'd you get for that what what'd you get for that money hey Joseph good morning it's not like you to be awake at this time two cores oh really how much memory very unlike me indeed have you got a have you got something at uni due today or something joseph is that why you're awake this early also thank you for the sub much appreciated Meeting a friend and didn't want to sleep through it. Oh, that's nice. I'm shit and I sleep through it. I sleep through meeting my friends. I'm such a bad friend to people. Holy shit. Meeting a you see you meeting a friend. Now that makes me think they're more than a friend. The fact that you don't want to sleep through it, but you know I'm just gonna I'll I'll leave the speculation to not on stream. Um, I'll let you have your own private life. <laughs> um, four gig DDR three. That's not bad, I guess. Eleven euro. Eleven euros. That's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's cheaper than most places, to be fair. Actually, thinking about it. So. I um. Just use it for backups. Let's have a look. Oh, that's not bad. That's the Scaleway Deadly Box. I was looking at Scaleway Elements, which is the cloud stuff. But all cloud is expensive in reality. Because, there's, you, the, because of the guarantee. I saw, um, can't be asked for cloud. I mean, I see some use to cloud. Cloud could be useful. I'm used to deadies. I'm very much used to deadies, but I can I can deal with cloud. That's what I have to do now. I, have to, I kind of have to deal with cloud these days. B2 is actually a very good. Uh, B2's pricing is. B2 is fucking very good. I saw an article this week. I uh, sort of thing I read it today. Well, uh, some guy was running a, some guy was gave a tutorial on how to run a, a CDN using B2 and Cloudflare. Um, and then someone was like, "Oh, be careful, because um, this might violate the terms of service for Cloudflare." And um, there's a bit in the terms of conditions that says, uh, or terms of service, it says uh, there's restrictive restrictive use of Cloudflare for serving of non-HTML files. Hmm. Which I found interesting, and then I realized it makes a lot of sense. Yeah, even if you pay for TF2. But it makes a lot of sense because they want to, they don't want you streaming, they don't want you doing video because they want you to use their video service. And they don't want you streaming images and stuff ridiculously because uh, that's a bandwidth and also they're bringing out their own imagery, imagery, imagery stuff um, so it makes kind of a lot of sense but yeah. mm. what's this GLaDOS backups 4 terabytes nice good job Good job, good job. I need to sort out some backup solution. But, I mean, I have B2 personal for my computer, but I don't worry about that too much. Um, I only have one terabyte kick. <laughs> well, it's the benefit of the cloud, isn't it? You're not limited. So. Huh.
I can't remember, I don't think I set up any nice local rules for the V2 stuff that I use. It's right. Mm. My main daddy is raid zero or one though. Okay. I did a stream last on the weekend of me moving my uh, my infra to my new daddy with Hetzner. I was using um Creep Host and then I uh, got I moved to a new server. Um, better specs for better price, pretty much. And I've been meaning to, I had the, I had I've had the server for like over a year now, and I just hadn't moved anything over. I just hadn't got around to it. So I finally decided to do it. And improve some caching stuff on the longer way as well, actually. So pretty happy. Sick, man. <laughs> mm, nah. Fun. Oh, using OPH. Good job. Well done. Um, oh, okay. I'm going to pull up the word. I'm going to pull up Wordle. Um, by the way, just, just pull it up. We're going to do, do today's Wordle. gonna start with the classic every single time we're starting a crate not really sure why it's just the first word that came to my head the first time i ever did wordle and so that is what i i i've just used every single time ever since i've done the wordle i'm off to a crack and start off to a crack and start we've got an r and e E on the end, E on the end, okay. Interesting, interesting E on the end. Um, I keep thinking of T words and I've got to remember there's no T. So, R at the beginning maybe? There's no A. Right. Ah, oh, I keep fucking. There's no. Wow. Something. I R E Y. Mm. Something. Something. Like that. Oh, damn. In free. In free. Uh, oh, this is your current server. Let's have a look. Uh, Proxmox. Oh, you've done a bit of... I, 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 yeah, nice. Cool. I'm glad you've done some filtering here. 12 times AMD Ryzen 5 3600X. Is this a OVH server? Also using 100% of two gig swap. Yeah. What did we say my server was again? I can't remember. This one. What is the... So, I get double the memory for that price. That's what I get. Same processor. I don't know what your drives are like. But. but no, 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 no. Nice.
I don't like the reviews on hats there, though, as they like to block around at random block parts. Do they? Never had an issue. Never had an issue with it. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah, Ray one, but, yeah, that's fine. Hmm. Interesting. Never, never had an issue with them. I mean, the thing that fucks me off is the setup price, setup fee, but I've paid that now, so don't really care. What have you some reviews on the problem, mate? Mine. All right. Um, yeah, I like the names of your servers as well, by the way. Scan shit. Fucking react. Kind of piss head. Matt Forehead. Nice. Do they have KVM? Uh, oh, I don't even fucking remember. Do they have KVM? That's the KVM. I think they do. Yeah, you can request a KVM via robot, apparently. Scan shit is so to keep that makes sense. I'm not sure how... Um, KVM is probably not. Um... Fucking Hetzna robot. It's not like the same as fucking. That is like, I like OVH, AKVM all the time, yeah. It's not like OVH where everything is all. KVM DAP. I must say, the ability to upload an ISO over the KVM is very useful. Was, hang on, I was reading an article on how to get KVM. I was gonna I, I just loaded up robot. I wanna see what a V KVM. Wait, what was that? Oh wait, no, that's not what I was doing. I was like, what? Go to the support tab. And you have to order a KVM there. Oh god, right. Oh god. Yeah, remote console. Yeah, it's a pain in the ask. It's a pain in the ask. Yeah. Still waiting for support. I'll order. Yeah, I know. It's just it's fine. I've never needed it, but. When did I first buy this? Can I see? Yeah, the other thing about um. AVH is, um, not AVH, about, that's there, is, um, I moved away. I moved away from Zer for that reason. They said, "Did let me have my own KVM." Who's done that? I don't know who Zer are. Never heard of them. Um, oh fuck! What was I gonna say? I can't remember. Can I look at my traffic statistics. Oh, I can. I look at my the daily report for yesterday. Did like no traffic. Did like two hundred, two hundred, two hundred meg total in the day. In the last year. Oh wait, hang on. In last year I did how much traffic? Two hundred forty gig, mostly in March. It must be nearly a year then since I bought it. Maybe it's gonna be a month free last year. Nice. And I have a friend of mine who um. Got stuck in another year contract with an OVH server. And they managed to get out of it by just messaging them. <laughs> okay. Uh, um. Ha, huh, interesting. I did 240 gig. That's quite impressive. 
200 of that was um, outgoing. Interesting. But yeah, I must have ordered this a year ago. Nearly. Love it. Save my ass so many times. Yeah. KB OPMI. KBM. Yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Very useful to have. I can't believe I got the word all that quick. I've got to share that, haven't I? Oh, shit. There we go. There's my word, old Fred. There he is. Bam, wham, down in free. Look at that, beautiful. Get up, paddock. Oh, fucking get up, honey. Only thing with aviation is they can be a bit, uh, a bit flappy sometimes with stuff, which is not, not fun. To find like a a quicker game, a quicker game, a clicker game. Fuck me, I'm, I must be tired. Um, still need to find like a clicker game for these mornings because I still haven't found one. I oh, know I found plenty. I just not not one that I've started playing. I guess. I remember when I tried to first use Proxmox many fucking years ago, and I failed. I wanted, um, I don't, I don't know why. I was struggling so much, I don't really know why. I had a server with... Use this for a file? So box, oh, PFSense, yeah, yeah. Um... I had a server with like, um, what was the name? I can't fucking remember what their name was. But um, it was some American, some American provider, very, very cheap. And they gave you a slash. What did they give you? Got like four IPs. What's the fucking? I can't remember the fucking. Um... Uh, how many? How many four? How many four IPs? Uh, I can't remember. I can't remember how many four IPs. Uh, thirty. I think is this like is it slash thirty? That would make sense. Yeah, that would make sense. Okay, maybe it was a slash party. Don't really remember. Anyway, they gave you four IPs. And I tried to set up Proxmox on the server, and I wanted to give each... I had, like, two separate VMs inside. I wanted to give each VM its own IP, and I just couldn't get that to work. It just wouldn't work. I don't really know why. I couldn't figure it out. I spent forever on it and gave up. I went about price either actually. I, don't, I just can't remember how much it was. Back in the day when people sent out IPs. My friend has just panicked me because they said, Are you good for nine? And I was like, Nine? I thought we said half nine. And I just looked at the messages above and it was said half nine. And he's like, Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I was like, panic, I'm not ready for nine. I can't get there for nine. I could get if I left if I literally got out of my chair now I could make it for nine. But 
I don't have that time. So, Joseph, are you still here? Joseph's still here? I want to hear about this. What, is, what are you? Who are you? Who's this friend you're going to meet? And what are you doing? What are you going up to? I know you can have a private life. I'm just intriguing. If you don't want to answer, you don't have to. Just intrigued. We should go for a pint again sometime, Joseph. It's been a little while. How long has it been? A few months. A few months since we last went for a pint, Joseph. When Zed came, like when Zed came down. Yes. Um. We walked past you in KFC and we were like, come out. And so you you went home and then came out. And um, Where did we go? Where did we go after the pub? Went somewhere. Don't remember where. Was it? Wasn't? No, I don't remember where we went after pub. We should have been going, well, uh, I don't know what we're doing. They're only stopping here for an hour. Ah, oh, okay. Only an hour. Okay. Go grab a coffee or something then. We should have been quite well. Yeah, we have. What do we do after? I just leaked the Wordle. I don't leak the Wordle. The Wordle leaks itself on the fucking website every day. <laughs> it's got the next year's worth of Wordles just sat on the website in the source code. I'm not leaking nothing. I'll fucking hide my screen then. Oh, if you don't want to see the answers, hide my screen. Yeah, I know. Yeah. That was a fun time. I figured that out. What's he saying to me? Oh, he said cool. I thought you replied again. Unless the crunch would change. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, I have a back end where you just do it all on the front end. Just saying. Just saying. And someone was a person wrote about it on Hacker News and got lots of comments and updates. Ah, that's nice. <laughs> like this started as just like a, a game for the person and their partner, right? It started. That's how it started. This could have been me. Could have been you. Yeah, yeah. It's the same guy who did the Reddit button and the Reddit, um, Reddit map. Reddit place, that's the one. Yeah, oh yeah, everyone, Mastermind, yeah, that's what everyone compares it to. I've had loads of people compare it to Mastermind. I, um, commitment ends July, 3rd of July 2022, ooh, sad. You can renew though, right? I'm sure you can renew. Also, oh, do you get two IPs with with OVH by default, or are you paying for a second IP? I don't think they gave you a secondary IP. Oh, yeah. Failover IP, right? A pound. That's fucking cheap. Hats now changed their pricing for their, their fucking um, IPs because they're running out of space. They're running out of IPv block. Um... Which is quite funny. Why is Hudson so pricey? Ah, uh, yeah. Like, what? I probably, I could probably get a better deal on OVH, to be honest. But, at the time that I bought it, I bought it for a Minecraft server. Hey, Jake. I bought it for, like, a modded Minecraft server that I was, um, running for someone. Um, it was like a subscriber server or whatever, or a community server. And just kind of... It was like, oh, my box is not cutting it. I need more processing power. This'll do. I got it. How are we doing this morning, Jake? Are you cheaper places? Um... It's a lot of money, isn't it? Want to virtualize stuff. Also, when I call a few minutes, I know. We don't worry about it, Jake. Um, you could try... Um, uh, oh, wait. Who, uh, you need something you can get. Um, try OVH. 
Maybe I'll wait until I get a job. That's probably a sensible idea. Are you going to get a job whilst you're at uni? Or are you going to stick how you are? Have you found somewhere to live for next year as well? I'm asking all the questions today, Joseph. You don't, I, I don't talk, chat to you often, so. Gotta ask all the questions whilst you're here. So enjoy the summer, hopefully, probably. Nice, sounds good, sounds good. In software or just a job or. I'm probably saying where I am, but friends say they might have a space next year. Oh, nice, that's good. Cybersec, yeah, yeah. I've got a family member who works. To be honest, you want to stay there. Fair enough. Is it nice there? Close to the pub, you are. Fucking close to the pub. Um, I know someone who works um, MOD doing cybersecurity. I like not having to deal with people. Oh, yeah, I wish. I wish I could do that. Oh, I wish I didn't have to deal with people. Dealing with people is a pain in the ass. Especially people you don't know. Um, oh, as I was going to say, is, um, I don't know if they've got anything going. They might have something going over the holidays. So if you're interested in doing a cybersecurity thing over the summer in the MOD, I can ask. Um, I'm not sure if they have got anything, but I can always ask. Um, but I imagine it might be on site. Actually, no, it's probably remote, actually. I don't know. Actually, they might not do anything because you have to have lots of security stuff. Ignore what I said. <laughs> just like offering out my fucking family members. which is like, oh yeah, no, that won't work because you have to have a lot of... It's a lot of hassle. Hmm, free family members. Why have I been recommended a Cubecraft video on my fucking YouTube channel? God damn. Uh, by the way, everyone, if you're here, little announcement for you. I'm uploading all my stream VODs to YouTube now. So if you want to go and watch my streams again, you can go do that over on YouTube. YouTube.com slash you slash Mr. Rushmeat. I think that works. I don't know, actually. Oh, slash, just slash Mr. Rushby might work, actually. Yeah, slash, slash Mr. Rushby works. Just use VODs. Did I finish them? Did I finish what? Did I finish what? What? Uh, I know. I've, they stay on Twitch as well. But if you prefer watching them on YouTube for whatever reason, they're also there. Also gives me a new fucking audience, you know? People might see the VODs and be like, what the fuck is this stream? And then go watch. Then again, I probably have to put more interesting titles than what I've put. But we'll tr I'll try from now. Um, to be honest, I do, I do much prefer YouTube as a platform for watching pre-recorded content. Watching live content on Twitch on YouTube is shit but pre-recorded content is awful when is the coding starting oh fuck me yeah okay no you, I'm not allowed to Joseph uh what is the coding saying I, the coding probably won't start probably not today Ugh, yeah sometimes it happens I haven't got a project at the moment I did have an idea for a project overnight a stupid project that I want to do um it was a stupid project, and it's just like, how would they even know? They'll, they'll know. Do you know you know that video where they're like, they're not gonna know. They'll know. Then how how are they gonna know? You know that one? Do, you, do I need to put up? How are they gonna know? 
Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna pull up anyway. It's funny. Nobody's gonna know. Wait, can you? You can't hear. Hang on. Okay. Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. How would they know? How would they know? How would they know? I haven't seen the original. There's no way this is the original. That's. That, that that cannot be the original. No way that's the original. Bullshit. Call him bullshit on that. Um I had a fucking stupid idea for like a Discord bot that people could like send a command to once a day or something, and it would send me a pushover alert. Like the, the the original idea, well, that's not that's kind of like the very basic aim. Of, that's the very base of the idea. The other the idea on top of that is that like the the idea behind it is like <laughs> would be like the, the kind of the, the, the reason I thought it was like if people wanted me my attention, like like it was like oh somebody needs a hug from me. But I can't physically give them a hug, so I'll send them like hugs as like a thing, right? And I was like, how people get my attention are they can just message a bot and it'll send me a pushover alert to be like, this person wants hugs. And then I'll go and message them and be like, hugs. <laughs> that was really such a stupid idea. But that's where it came from originally. And I was like, oh, I just build it for my friends. And then I was just like, oh, but if I put like the right limits in place, like you can only send it once every like 24 hours or whatever per person, then it wouldn't be too bad. But I guess if I make it a Discord bot, you could invite it to servers. And yeah, it could be, yeah. You could, a lot of people could message that. Yeah. At everyone, if you message this bot saying hugs question mark, it will send Stuart. It will send my friend. Oh, it's such a stupid idea. See, any project that I wanted to start, that I would wanted to do on here, I wanted to start in Rust because um, that DMs go to your phone too, right? Yes, but. DMs on Discord get blocked after a certain time. And I'm not removing that because it gets very annoying. Discord notifications after a certain time. And so the idea was that my pushover my pushover alerts go through everything. Always over always override. And so the idea was that generic's coming soon to go. I've been I, I've written my fair a little bit ago. I was about to say my fair share. I haven't written my fair share. I've written a, a bit ago. Uh, okay, it's nice. Um, I know a lot of people's pain points are. If, if Nyax was here, they'd be saying what I'm about to say. Um, pain points is. Um, having to write if error does not equal nil or all the time <laughs> like half your file is fucking if error does not equal nil um <laughs> I, but I, I i to me it forces good error handling but i also understand that it's a pain in the ass i was gonna say that what the fuck is dp double penetration there's no double, double, double penetration in golang what the fuck Dependency injection is what you meant. And yes, I understand now. Oh, fuck me. What's this? Not been to bed yet. Neither have I. Double penetration. <laughs> Uh, I'm just gonna put. Boop, 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 boop. We'll write in Go Lang instead. Fuck it. We'll write in Go Lang. 
What's the fucking name of this called? What's the best um library? Discord Gophers. Is it Discord Go? Updated 20 days ago. Go to bed. Eat a fish cake. I can't go to bed. I got uni. I can't eat a fish cake. I threw it in the bin. <laughs> this library and the Discord API are unfinished. Nice. Smallery. Go by example, Discord bot and go. Yeah, that's all I normally do. I wrote um I wrote a little I wrote a little um a neat little tool that I want to that is actually something I do want to do for reals actually. Um I don't write C sharp. I have written C sharp and I don't do it. <laughs> uh I can't wait to I can't wait to re you on Friday. I can't wait to be stabbed by Will. Um, I, I, I'm going to spend all week just making, making people like upsetty and then get to see them on Friday and they're all going to hate me. It's going to be great. It's going to be the best thing ever. Um, so one of the things I actually do want to do, which is a good project for stream, um, and like, it will take a little while. It'll be more than, but pie, I know, right? Uh, which will take a little while and be be a multi-stream project and probably quite good for the morning i already have the base of it written but i want to make it better um and i want to make it public and i want to make it a cloud service for people to use uh, basically i have a little tool that randomly generates me a new skin every day it doesn't work it, haven't, it used to run on the cron job and used to work every actually work it hasn't been running automatically for a while it does still work i have a copy of it Yes, I have a copy of it. Um, but I want to um, make it public and make it so that people can sign in with Microsoft and basically have their skin change every day with like a, they can pick like, oh, change this. This is my base skin and change this and do this and do that. Basically, that was what I want to do. Bubble tea. Oh, this looks fucking nice. What the fuck? What did I recently? I wrote. I wrote. I started writing a CLI tool in Rust recently. Actually, this is nice. Gonna star this. Use that another time. Oh, it was uh, hilarious, right? Okay, sorry. This is this is slightly political, right? So obviously, yesterday the um, the, the uh, Sec secretary for culture announced that they were freezing the TV license and that it's going to be scrapped in 2027 or something. Emma Mario, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Um, is that Emma M M M M M Mario? Sorry, um, I saw an advert on LinkedIn that was like 2022. In 2022, the BBC is going to be the best thing or something like that. I was like, it was like, we're going to make 22 the best year for the BBC or something. And I was just like, yikes, that didn't age well. That that didn't age well, did it? It is. You're, you're, yes. 
difficult. I mean, two billion is a lot of money to lose. It's a lot of fucking money to lose. Um, I mean, I don't know what the funding is going to be for the rest of it. To be honest, I don't know where they're going to get their funding from. But they're going to lose lose out on two billion. Where the fuck is that going to come from? Um, I just don't know. They'd save so much money if they stopped sending messages, I know, right? Love the BBC. <laughs> Listen, nah, let's not give Big Black Clock so much hate, alright? Anyway. Funny little joke. Had someone had to make it, and it was me. How's your uh, how's your morning call going, Jake? Hope 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 it's going well. Hope morning call morning call is great. Let me know when it's my turn. All right. Let me know when it's my turn to do morning call. Cheers, thanks. Um, yeah. One billion goes to see you for sure, though. Man. Hmm. Okay. Code. Oh, you're going to actually make me write code this morning? Are you really, really going to make me write code? Fuck it, L. L's bells. I have already written code this morning, just not on stream. All right. All right. We'll do a little bit. We'll do a tiny little bit. The title says code. All right. The title has said code for the past, like, four morning, f five morning, six mornings. And I haven't written a single line of code in any of the mornings, I don't think. I think I wanted to. I was just like, I don't have a project to do. But I've now thought of one. Uh, we're going to do the dumb the dumb Discord bot today. All right. We're going to do, we'll do the dumb Discord bot. Oh, fuck me. Why is this so shit? Uh, yeah, no, don't do this. Oh, fuck me. We'll do the dumb Discord bot. Uh... I assumed if you were doing these six days in a row that... Oh, no, no, no. Do not do not be fooled by the title. This is not six days in a row. <laughs> I have not woken up on time six days in a row. I've woken up on time six days alternately. So it's been 12 days? It's not been 12 days. It's been 10 days. Did I increase the number by one by accident? How many of these have I done? Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. This is number six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. It's not been 12 days. Oh wait, no, but tomorrow it will be 12 days. Because I started this on the 7th. One. What? So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Yeah, it's six. Are you cheating? Started on seven. Sorry. Don't worry. It's all good. I can count. I can count. Promise. I just can't math. I can count. I just can't math. Yeah, this is six. This is six. This is six. So it's all good. Um, new new bot. It's called Hugbot. Hugbot. Trust. Go mod. Go in it. How do I? How do I? How do I go? Go mod in it. Uh, uh, hang on. I, I, don't worry, I'm just gonna do it in GoLand instead. I will share my screen once I fucking got fucking a project open. I haven't got anything open yet. Oh, you should worship. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, my license expired. <laughs> this is why I'm not using GoLand. I remember. Yeah, 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 I remember. How do I go these days? What time do I need to go? In about 
you, you not consistently alternated over right. You managed two in a row at point. No, I didn't. I, I've done it entirely. I've done it entirely alternately, I think. Unless I... I'm pretty sure I've done it entirely alternately. Uh, I don't get a uni license. No. Well, I, I can get one for GitHub PG. Edu. I literally have to even like six minutes time, by the way. So, <laughs> so seven minutes. Where is the code? All right. Hang on a bit. Uh, write it in Java, not Rust. Writing it in Go. I need to use slash commands. If it's alternate, you can say it's on purpose. Well, that's what I did say. Echo mod in it. GitHub.com. Slash rush made. Slash. Hug bot. Boop. It's okay. Don't worry. No, 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 no. I was. I didn't say it today. I just said that. I, I did say that to people. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I did this on purpose. Oh, wait. Shit. You want me to show you? Did, sorry. Did you want me to show you the screen? Okay. I can code. Wait, I had an article on how to do this already. Open. Wow. Wow, I'm looking so good. Oh, I'm just fucking too good at this. Bang. Shit. <laughs> Go get this. Steal this. Go. This thing was like, oh, you should use fucking all this config shit. Fuck that. Oh, we're just gonna... This is a speedrun speed Discord bot. Speed block is why is block broken all of a sudden? Oh, I haven't enabled. I know. Hang on, hang on. Sorry, my bad. Uh, my bad. That is that is actually my bad. That is really my bad. All right, there we go. Scammed. Sorry. Do it again. It'll work that time. <laughs> I can't resend it. I'm really sorry. I just keep forgetting to log in, man. There we go. I just keep forgetting to log in. Just keep getting to log in. All right, we got, we got. Oh fuck! I'm trying to write the code. We're speed, we're speed running the code here, guys. Come on. Go. <laughs> All right, how do I? How, wait, how do I do this? Uh, you, there, yeah, make a good bot, and then no, no. Yeah. Oh, hang on. The, I, this is the block that I missed. That's enough. Um. Oh, I thought. Oh, that nearly broke. That nearly broke my fucking Firefox. Holy shit! The blocks nearly fucked me over. Um, Jack is here to make me large. Thank you. Is this really how this works? Is this is it really that simple? Okay. Um. So we're just gonna do. Give up. Error. Discord go. But. Uh, oh, it's not getting. Discord taken. We go over us. Do I need commas here? <sighs> Fuck it, I can't remember how this works. Uh, no. Um. If error does not equal nil, then panic. Error. Um. <laughs> We wanna get. We wanna get. Panic error. <laughs> uh, but ID. You ID. Okay. Oh fuck. You just use GitHub Go. I am using GitHub Go. Oh no, I don't. I'm not. Okay, my bad. But I, I thought I was. So that means I must have been. Uh, go bot. No. Add. Handle that. <laughs> and the message. Oh man, I'm so good at speed running this. Okay, just copying from the page that I can see in front of me. Message create. Yeah, that's what I thought. Bam. Alright. Handle message. And then error equals go bot dot open. If error does not equal nil, then panic. Error. Else bot open. I will put empty as well. Okay. 
uh, fm.offer.id. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. There we go. Oh, oh, uh, equals bot ID. Oh, wait, shit, what did I call it? Oh, fuck, is that? Okay, cool. Oh, wait, I forgot to say what it is. It's a string. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay, uh, bot ID. I'm not even in chat, I'm fucking just coding. Return. We don't care. It's not us. Right. Um I don't know. What is this use again? Do they have support for fucking flash commands yet? <sighs> Examples. Flash commands. Boop. Main. Uh, you know what? This seems like a lot of effort. You can go now. I'm just reading. What the fuck is this? Where the fuck is S come from? S is a Discord session. New Discord session. Oh, that's the Discord go. Okay. So. Application create command for the command. Needs the handler. Oh well, I'm gonna go. We'll finish this. We'll finish this tomorrow. Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, I gotta get through like an hour of uni. Holy shit! I gotta get through an hour of uni. So do you wanna see some code I did write on stream? Yeah, it's a short stream. I mean, I was going to start at like half seven, but I started at like eight instead. Um, some kind of did right this weekend. Hang on, let me load up for me first. Uh, was this? I was awake. I was awake uh, all night. Anyway, for 132 lines of just pure beauty. Can't see. Eh, 150 lines of pure beauty. Wow, oh, oh, beautiful. So beautiful. Right, I'm out of here. Suckers, you all suck. JK, love you. I'm gonna finish my coffee. Ah, if you want to get a cool ass mug like mine, mine's mug. You can head to buymyfuckingmug.com and get yourself one. Buy my fucking mug. I assume it still fucking works. It does. Buy my fucking mug.com. It's not even my mug. It's not even my mug. I'm not, I'm just I'm just advertising it for the sake of advertising. Um, so yeah. You can see where this has been green screened. This video that you can't see on my screen because I'm not. Anyway, that's been nice. Time to move on. Good riddance. Yeah, and to you too, you fucker. Ciao, ciao. Have a good one. Thanks for coming along. I love you all. Thanks for the follows. Thanks for the subs. Thanks for the just general chatter about shite. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Maybe. Or the morning after. Depending on how I feel. Good night. Wait. Goodbye. What? Confusion. Ah. I'm so confused. What's going on? Help. How do I get out of it? How do I leave? How do I turn this off? Is this all? Is it still on? I can't. How do I? Nope. Gotta stop. Drink coffee. Eat food. Go to the bathroom. Oh, have a shave. That's what I needed to do. I don't have time for that. Goodbye.